Hi guys, it's Monique with Oak Knob Makes and I am back with you today to talk about the Michaels $4 grab bags I got. Do you guys know about these $4 Michaels grab bags? So every uh, season, whether it's, you know, Easter and spring, 4th of July, uh, autumn slash Thanksgiving, Christmas and New Year's, Michael's always has that seasonal stuff. Well, at the end of the season, they put it on clearance sale and then, you know, they clearance it up to like 80% off and then whatever they don't sell, they put together in bags and then they sell the bags for $4. And obviously everything you get isn't going to be everything you want, but you never know what you're going to get. It is like Christmas, special Christmas. So I went today, I've been calling like every two days for a week and a half because I've been trying to hit this Christmas $4 grab bag for like two years and I missed it the last two years and I really need some new like Christmas decor and I just don't want to spend the money on it. I mean, there's just a lot of things I'd rather spend money on. Craft supplies, Christmas presents for people, um, the first couple of years we were here, I invested about a hundred, hundred and fifty dollars a year in decorations. Well, that got me the first year got me um, some new Christmas ornaments for the tree and enough garland to go around the beams in the dining room and kitchen. The next year I got a huge wreath for the front of the house and candles for all of the windows. That's what we do is we put candles in all of our windows and normally we put up the big wreath and it's lit and it's kind of up on the front of our house. Uh, last year we couldn't do it because the plug that we have to plug it into, there's something wrong and Dave just didn't have a chance to fix it before Christmas. So we didn't put it out this past year. I also didn't put out the candles because the cats, we, the cats were new. Christmas was a little bit of, um, <laughs> it was a little bleh with the cats. They're new to us. We just got them, I think in July. Anyways, I thought I would, open up these bags, which in this case are all boxes. They put them all in boxes. I would open them up and we would see what I got. I bought seven boxes at four bucks. So what is that, $28? Not too bad. You're just gonna have to excuse the occasional reflection off my glasses and also my need to hydrate. Okay, talking in these videos actually dries your mouth out a lot more than you would think. I think some of it is obviously like nerves. I have a tower of boxes next to me. I'm waiting for the whole thing to fall on me or a few. Um, okay, so basically you go in and this is what you see. $4 grab bags. No coupons or additional discounts can be applied. Okay, I'm good with that. And this is what the box looks like. They take them up. They don't really encourage you peeking. Um, I think I've heard that some people that have peeked at other places, like every other time I've seen them or gotten them, um, they were in bags. So this time they're in boxes, which is different from my store, but it could have been, oh, well, okay. First thing, <laughs> wow. It's a Christmas tin. That's kind of sweet. Merry Christmas. What is this? <laughs> Look at it. It's little Santa lighted path markers. Isn't that hysterical? That's $30 normally. So that's $30 right there. $34. And first two things out of the first box, I, I paid for all of it. What's the next thing? Okay. 35 piece, a little squash on this side, 35 piece Christmas Noel shatterproof ornament. This is normally $30. They're actually quite pretty. Some of the white, I don't think you, oh, there you can kind of see it's like kind of shimmery and glittery. I'm sorry about the lighting guys. My phone started to die. So I have only a short cord and I've got lights in weird places and just doing my best. Okay. What's next? Oh, hey, look at a bag of pine cones. Only six bucks. Hey, you know. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, guys. So I got a whole bunch of these. <laughs> They're little ballerina sticks. 
you know. Um, these are five bucks a piece. I got 12 of these. So $60 worth of ballerina picks. This is kind of a neat pick. There's no tag on it, but it's an antler. Like, I would totally put that in some sort of a Christmas holiday. It's too bad I don't have two of them, but, you know, it is what it is. And then this is very cute. Just a lollipop pick. That is $4. So, and what is this? Oh, cool. This is a DIY plastic ornament. Normally $2. It's both pieces. Oh, guys. I love this. Um, this is also a pick. <laughs> I love gnomes. I love them. Well, I think a lot of people like gnomes, which is why they're kind of trendy and hot right now. But I was liking gnomes before it was popular. But for Mother's Day one year, I got uh, the roaming gnome. Does anybody remember the commercial for the roaming gnome where <laughs> he's sitting on the couch eating Cheetos and he's got the Cheeto dust around his mouth? And it's just a plastic gnome. And a little lip dip dee. I need to get out of here. I did a little lick dick. That for some reason, I died laughing every time I saw that commercial. So for Mother's Day that year, the kids got me um, a roaming gnome figure and um, like resin one and a bag of Cheetos. <laughs> So I, I really laughed really hard. But we took that gnome on vacation with us many times. And we took pictures of it. I need to get out of here. Unfortunately, he died this year in a tragic screen door slash railing accident during a storm. Mr. Gnome was up top there along with another one that I was given and it was, they just shattered. So I lost my gnomes. Anyways, back to this, like this is going to be a long video guys. I'm sorry. Maybe I'll break it up into a couple. So here it is. It is very cute. It was $2. So that is, uh, oh no, there's more. What is this? Oh, this is slimy reindeer droppings. Fluffy and scented slime, slimy with mix. I don't know what this is. Is this this slime stuff that I see a lot of parents say they, they detest? Is that what this is? It looks like it's weird. I've got three of those. I'll have to look that up. I don't see that it says how much it is. It's weird that it looks like little torpedoes too. Because nothing says Christmas spirit like a torpedo. That wasn't a bad box. There's several things in there that I would use. This box number two. Let's get the scissors out. Sorry about that, guys. I don't know what happened. My phone just shut off. There was another unicorn in that box. Um, this, <laughs> this is a Celebrate Christmas Noel ribbon. When you stroke it there, that sounds good, but let me see if I can, there you go. See, you can change the color from red to green. Three and a half inches by two yards, so six feet, non-wired ribbon. That's normally 15 bucks. That was, look at this, more Santa lights. This is for indoor and outdoor use. Yeah, maybe I could mark up the stairs, put them on the stairs. Well, Mark is be like a landing strip to go to bed at night. And look at this. Snowman. Three of them. That is so cute. These are also 30 bucks a piece. So that's all that was in that box. A bunch of those unicorn and truck and donuts. The donuts are different too. One of them is blue and one of them is just pink and white. Um, so that's pretty cool. At least there's a little variety there. And then this thing... And two of the, I'm pretty stoked about those actually, and I'm not even into those, but I just think those are, those are fabulous. Oh, and the tin. Let's move on to the next box. That's $7. Here's another one. $7, same thing. Another one. $7. Same thing. So we got three of those. <laughs> we got a little camper pick. That's six dollars. 
Oh, ice cream prom picks. One, two. This would be fun. Oh my gosh, they got jimmies on the top of them. That is funny. I love that some of them have sleeves and some of them don't. Because they are very glittery. And I have a feeling that there's going to be some significant glitter in my on my futon here. I, I don't know about any of you ladies. Well, some of you ladies, I'm sure, are at the same stage of life that I'm at. Called perimenopause. But it makes sleep difficult for me. So on the days that I'm very restless and I know that I'm probably going to wake up Dave, I come and I, I lay down in here. So um, I'll probably be covered in glitter tomorrow. These were um, six bucks a piece. Oh, we've got some stars. These are kind of pretty. These are four bucks a piece. We have another poinsettia. Oh, this is heavy. This is sturdy, guys. It's like a gingerbread house pick. This was six dollars. Looks like we've got a whole bunch of those lollipop. There's three of those, four bucks a piece. Oh, this one got a little jacked up. Look at the little angels. Those are sweet. Those are six dollars each too, and it looks like there's three of them. Oh, look at two, one, two, three bags of pine cones. Oh, look at this. These are sweet. They are um, treat bags that say baked with love. So it's like the plastic bag. And then in the back is the, it's cardboard. You put it over the top, I think, and I don't know, maybe you staple through it, but that's sweet. There's 18 in each package and they're um, five bucks each. These are really cool ornaments, but they're $3 a piece. They're really neat. They're oval and kind of thin. We've got two celebrated bows, three bucks a piece. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is wired ribbon, 25 feet. It's so pretty. It's red. Oh, this is also really pretty. It's a gold one. It's wired, but it's a different texture. It's kind of silky. Um, that's $15. Oh, we have another. Oh, this is a thin kind of white with gold shimmer ribbon, $10 normally. Oh, marquee letters. This is a Y. What is this? It's an I. Maybe coming soon to a Facebook marketplace near you. So that's all that was in this box, which is still a pretty good box. Those ribbons alone are pretty expensive, and all these poinsettias, those are not cheap. What did the English say? Pretty chuffed with that. Okay, we got four boxes left. This one's kind of heavy. Well, heavy compared to the other ones, you know. Oh, I have a U. Oh, we got some ribbon. This is 25 feet wired ribbon gold, sparkly. 10 bucks. There's some ribbon that wants to come undone. This is 10 bucks. It's kind of a gold. Well, this one is actually wired. Well, this is cool. This is $6. It's a wreath hanger for over the door. Another bag. Bag O pine cones. Oh, with, look at, with a unicorn. Oh, another train. There's some more ribbon. This is wired, kind of white with some gold. There you go. You can see it. And this is just another very shiny gold ribbon. Both of them are $10. Oh, we have Christmas cards. Believe in the magic of Christmas. 16 cards and envelopes, normally 15 bucks. Oh, here's more Christmas cards. 16 American greetings. This is normally $8. This one is more of a religious thing. Oh, and it's, look, at it's an exact same one. So, oh, wait, these are little Christmas ornament cookie cutters, two bucks a piece. And here's another thing of ribbon, $10. It's just gold. Felt stocking kit. Oh, so this is a craft, a kid craft. This is cute. This is another fabric thing. Oh, that last thing was $15 normally, and the stocking kit was five. Pine cones were six bucks. This was $20, and it is the Elf Treehouse, also of foam. Cute kids thing. Oh, this one says it lights up. This was $19. It's a Christmas train. Oh, I got another tin. Oh, and inside this tin is, and then this thing of ribbon, two yards. Does it flip and make a different color? It does, it does silver. So it's gold or it can be silver. That's $15 worth of ribbon. And that's it in that box. I get a little blue on Christmas myself. It's so much work and prep and everything. So, and then it's over before you know it. Okay, look at this. Wow, look at that. 
There's lots of white poinsettias. That's really actually very pretty. This was $20. Oh, look at this. This was $10. You just put it in a vase. It's kind of made to look like it's just sitting in a vase. Oh, yeah, and then this thing, which is just nothing but glitter. See, I take something like this, and I'll fill a huge hole on our Christmas tree. We get, we get real trees every year. This was $6. Um, so I'll fill a big hole. I'll, like, sit it right in there and whatever. I don't care. Works good. We've got another tin, so I'll probably... Oh my gosh, there's stuff inside this tin. There's a lot of very glittery leaves. These were two bucks a piece. Oh, look at those are cute. Little lights. One of them is missing. That is $4. This, I think, is hysterical. Is this not very Dr. Seuss? Oh, that was $4. We have another train. Oh, it's a coiled garland. So, whoops, one of the things fell off. What is this? A basic net light. 150 multicolored net lights for indoor and outdoor use. Six feet by four feet. One set. $16. Three more Santas. That gives us nine Santas. That was all that was in that box, guys. Okay, what is this? Oh, these are treat bags. So there's two snowflake treat bags. Those are actually really pretty. These were $3 each. Oh, look at this. This is like a whole poinsettia plant. And this was 10 bucks. Stocking stuffers. It's a watch. Press the middle bottom section of the watch. Yeah. It thinks it's $4.19. That was $5. Bling stickers. I don't know what I would bling up with it, but I don't know. Those were five bucks a piece. We have more outdoor bows. There's now five. Ooh, body glitters. That's right up my alley. You, I bet you know that about me, huh? <laughs> it's got a kitty on it, like, in space. Yeah, also $2.99. Oh, this is nice. It's a little tin. It's a Happy Hanukkah tin. It was 99 cents. We got a lot of cards, guys. Oh, we have another Bless This Lord one. This is very pretty. This is like a, the partridge in a pear tree. Everybody, these are the cards you're getting for the next several years. Another Bless the Lord one. And this one just says, Christmas! Greetings! $15 for 16 cards. Oh, another one of those felt gingerbread houses. Cookie cutters. It's a set of cookie cutters. Looks like gingerbread men and Christmas trees. It shows you on the back what there is. We have more body glitter. It's another gold kitty in space body glitter. Oh, it's another elf. Oh, oh guys, look at it. It's another Hanukkah card holder and more body glitter oh we have another train that lights up this was a good box this is what i needed was things that i could zhuzh up my house with at christmas I'm, i mean a lot of these things dave and i have had there since before we knew each other and and then add another 15 years to that so a lot of it is a pretty sad state although i'm not getting rid of my santa claus mr potato head ever Okay, this is the last box, everybody. I was kind of hoping to get maybe like some figurines or some sort of wall decor that I could put up as well because that's I'm pretty low on. And I don't seem to have gotten much in the way of that. So maybe I could make a huge garland for the wall out of pine cones and bows. Bless us, Lord, this Christmas. Um, okay, so here's another pick. Oh, look it, we've got the the... Oh, this one is in this one's in kind of rough shape. This is a whole bunch of little gold bows. And this was five dollars. These are foam stickers. They're eight dollars. It's like Jesus and Mary and Joseph, maybe, and then some stars, and then peace on earth. It says more pine cones. Okay, so here's two puffs that remind me also very much of Dr. Seuss for another camper pick. Guys, it is another one of another roll of that gorgeous red kind of crepey ribbon. This is enormous. This is a huge. It's four dollars. It's a round one like the one we got before, but it's bigger. This one is three dollars. Here's another ornament and a light. Oh, and another light. Oh, here's a little snowflake one. Oh, it's another baked with love. 
treat bag set. Look at its little picks, like party picks. And this one is says joyful. And this one is fa la 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 la. That makes me want to have a Christmas party. Oh, look, it's another one of those little plunger cookie cutters. This one is uh, a candy cane. This is crazy, guys. This is fuzzy white. It's wired and it's like fur, white fur. It's $15 and it's three yards. Oh, we have another. We have another uh, one of these. Another one of these giant ones. What is this? Oh, another treat bag. What is this? Oh my God, guys. It's a light box mini. I don't know what that is. Add tape, add slides, add letters. Oh, I think this lights up for like in my craft room, like a decorative thing. Oh, it totally does. You plug it in and it like makes a little, a little light up marquee. That's adorable. And that's normally $30. Hey, this is the letter eight. This is normally $18. Oh, that is awesome. That's what this is, guys. This, what I thought was a stamp, they made sure to put in with the mini thing, the letters. So in there is like three A's, two B's, two C's, two D's, normally five bucks. What is this? Insert photos and notes. It's like a little scrapbooky type thing. There's all these words. You can't see it. Let's see. There's all those words. There's a little heart. On the front of the book. Oh, and then there's like each page has just a slot for a picture. And next to it, a, this is date. And then there's lined pages for like notes. I might use this for like um, projects I make, like crochet projects. Oh, the last things that we have is another elf, foam elf thing. And then we got a different one. This one needs scissors. It is a little ice tower race with penguins and yetis and stuff. That's cute. That's $30. Uh, I'm going to be able to use a lot of it, and I feel pretty good about where I can donate some of it. And, and then I have stuff to share with friends as well, I think. My daughter does do some crafting, so there might be some things she wants here. Okay, everybody, I hope you enjoyed seeing the things that were inside my grab bags. Like I said at the beginning of the video, if you're unaware of this you should generally check a month after the holiday but you can just call your nearest store and ask them they will tell you if they have them out or you can ask if they know when they're going to go out and they will tell you my local store actually encouraged me to call them back every two days they were like just call us every two days and and i was like really and they said yeah we really don't mind it's not a big deal so that's what i did I think we got some good stuff. I will say the only thing I was kind of bummed about was that there was no wall decor of any kind, really. Okay, everyone. So that was the grand uh, Michael's $4 grab bag unboxings. Let me know in the comments below if you ever get these grab bags or were you even aware that it was a thing? What are your thoughts on the, the $4 grab bags? And of course, if you like this video, give it a like, subscribe, hit the little bell so that you know when I put out a new video. I uh, I think it's funny when I go in and I look. Uh, for those of you who don't do YouTube videos, we can look and see. Um, the majority of the views on my videos are from people that aren't subscribed. So I'm talking to you. Go ahead and just subscribe and uh, you'll get all of them. That would work for me. I enjoy uh, spending time with you all. I thank you for spending your time with me. And I look forward to the next time we hang out. Okay, bye guys.